Not the first thing in the frying pan, hi ya. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's AK here once again. Today I'll be reacting alone. Uh, Indy is not around. So we've been receiving a lot of requests to react to Uncle Roger once again. The one we reacted to the last time was very, very hilarious. It was so funny. So today we'll be reacting. Today, oh, I'm so used to saying we will be reacting. Today I will be reacting to Uncle Roger ate Jimmy Oliver egg fried rice. Oh, it's another egg fried rice video. I think this is going to be interesting. So, let's get started. Glazing. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Putting jam in rice. <laughs> this is disgusting. Who put jam? Wait. Hello. Jam said rice? I've never seen that before either. Oh, niece and nephew, it's Uncle Roger. Today, I I like the way he says his name. It's Uncle Roger. <laughs> Uncle Roger gonna react to this video requested by so many niece and nephew out there. It's Jamie Oliver making egg fried rice. Jamie Oliver is professional chef, very established. Everybody know him. So Uncle Roger think this one is gonna be good. I've been to many of his restaurants. Before we start video, niece and nephew, please smack the like button now like you slap a bag of rice. Don't make Uncle Roger sad. Smack like button. Now let's start the video. Egg fried rice, it's an absolute classic. And I've got a... Two seconds into Weijo and I already see saucepan Hiya, Where your wok? Jamie, where your <laughs> wok? Egg fried rice need to use wok because you need the wok, hey? Many people ask me. He, he probably doesn't have a wok. Uncle Roger, what is wok, hey? It is the breath of wok. When you cook with wok, the wok gives the food flavor. Get the wok, hey? No such thing as saucepan, hey? Jamie, you have 25 cookbook, but you can't afford one wok. Uncle Roger send you one wok for free, Jamie. No problem. I absolutely love <laughs> making this recipe. Yes, you can do this as a side dish, no trouble at all. But actually, it's heading towards being a really beautiful dinner. So, wait. Yes, you can do this as a side dish. Jamie say, egg fried rice is side dish? When Uncle Roger going up, when my mom make me egg fried rice, that is the main dish. That's I it. never tell my mom, oh mom, this egg fried rice is only side dish. <laughs> Where the main dish? Where the main dish? I would have been beaten to death. Oh my goodness. Slice this up. And as this pan gets nice and hot, I'm going to go in with one tablespoon of olive oil. And what? One tablespoon of, of what? I'm going to go in with one tablespoon of olive oil. Olive oil for egg fried rice? Who use olive oil for egg fried rice? Why are you making salad? Olive oil is like white people oil, not suitable for Asian dishes like egg fried rice. And I'm gonna go straight in. He's probably trying to cook healthy, you know. That's why people use olive oil. With the onions. And we'll get them sizzling straight away. And no, 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 no. Spring onion is garnish, it's garnish. You put spring onion as the last thing in your meal, not the first thing in the frying pan, hi -ya. <laughs> I think you know when he's really frustrated when he says hi -ya. <laughs> Then sizzling straight away. No, you don't sizzle spring onion. Nobody sizzles spring onion. If you cook spring onion now, it will wilt. It wilt. This should be garlic. First step should be garlic. This first three step all wrong already. I thought you professional chef. You have website and everything. Uncle Roger don't even have website and Uncle Roger know you fucked up. And then I've got some packet pre-cooked rice. Yes, you can cook your own. Packet. This guy owns so many restaurants and he still can't be bothered to make his own rice. Packet rice? Imagine if you go to a Japanese restaurant and you ask for noodles and the chef gives you instant noodle. That is th what this guy is doing. And rice, white rice, 12 minutes. But for stir-fried rice, you have to drain it and chill it. Uh, you have to chill it. He correct, but drain, don't, don't drain rice. Uncle Roger made a whole video, 12 million view now, of Auntie Hirsch are draining rice. Don't drain rice, but chill rice, correct. 45 seconds in, first thing he got correct. So for me, that feels like a good cheat. You can hear it sizzling. You hear sizzling, I hear my ancestors crying. It's fast, it's hot, it's furious. We're just 
toss it around. Oh right, my goodness. Then, oh, Uncle Roger don't like the look of this. He taking ingredient from this drawer and it, this drawer looks so white because Asian ingredient never come in jar. You ever notice that? Asian ingredient always come in plastic bag or bad packaging. If your packaging look this nice, nice jar, nice bag over there, then it's not Asian ingredient. Next ingredient. I have this in my home all the time now, chili jam. It's what I tell you, it's not Asian ingredient. What are you doing with chili jam? Let's see. Brilliant for cooking. It's got heat, but it's also got the sweetness and it's going to kind of glaze. Oh, no, 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 no. Putting jam in rice. This guy is ma he's making Uncle Roger cry. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is disgusting. Who put jam? First of all, what is chili jam? Uncle jam. Roger, no fresh chili, chili oil, chili flake. Never heard of chili jam. Is this Me how neither. you trick white people to eating chili? You give them fresh chili, they go. No, no, no. no I no, don't no. actually like chili. Give them chili jam and they go. Oh. Chili jam is so weird thing to use. Jamie, do you know about sriracha? This is Asian chili. Just use this. No need to use jam. What are you gonna put in there next? Peanut butter. Okay, why do you go bake PB and J egg fried rice? How many uh, things can a chef get wrong in one video? Hiya. Two Hiya. nice teaspoons go in to our pan and then just start. He doesn't look again. so appetizing. He tossed very poor, but he tossed all the wrong stuff. All style, no substance. That will start to coat every single rice grain. All style, no substance. Wow. And it will shine in the most beautiful way. And then just give it a little splash. Of water. Wait, what? 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 No. Why is it putting water? In the middle of cooking, you put water. Oh, oh my. Uncle Roger say, if your rice too wet, you fucked up. But if your rice too dry, you also fucked up. At this stage, just push the rice up the side of the pan like that, and then straight into the middle, we're gonna crack in two beautiful free-range eggs. Okay. Okay, the egg look good, egg look good. And then it's time for the last ingredient, which again, to a lot of people... He reaching for that shelf again. <laughs> so Uncle Roger don't think it's gonna end well. Uncle Roger just don't like that shelf. I think I it's can, the wrong I shelf for tell. egg fried rice. Maybe during filming, they put the wrong shelf there and Jamie's like, oh shit, you bought the wrong shelf. What I do now? And the filming people are like, we don't care. Just use whatever in the shelf. People is a bit of a new ingredient. Tofu. To Firm, silken tofu. Tofu? Why your tofu in juice box? Who make your tofu? Capri Sun? When Uncle Roger buy tofu at Asian market, always come in plastic bag, plastic seal wrapping. No tofu look like juice box. What, are you going to poke straw and drink your tofu? 50 grams. And what you can do is just break this up. No, and as no. It cooks. No. No! <laughs> Second time he's making him he cry. Make Uncle Roger put my leg down from chair. Baking tofu, like how Auntie Helen baked Uncle Roger hot. Asian cooking, when you cook tofu, you preserve the whole shape of tofu and serve to customer. This video, so many sad things happen. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm not Asian and I know that. I, this is the first time I've actually seen, them, seen a guy shredding the the tofu that's true he wastes the spring onion he wet the rice and now he tear apart the tofu like paper i don't know if uncle roger can go on this depression is too much i want chunks of egg and i want little bits so the nice thing about this stir fried rice is it's kind of random what he say what he say? The nice thing about this stir fried rice is it's kind of random. random. Random is not compliment. You make food for your friend one day, and your friend say, why are your food so <laughs> random? And Jamie say, oh my god, so random. Gonna start restaurant. Season with a little salt. Give it a little toss. To salt, again, no MSG. <coughs> but Uncle Rod to talk about MSG too many weeks ago. I mean, at up. least he's good at something. He's good at tossing the... This saucepan. And then we're ready to serve. Get a bowl, put a little oil. This guy loves olive oil like how Auntie Hersha loves colander. He put olive oil on everything. Do you shower with olive oil also? Don't go get massage from Jamie Oliver. He will put olive oil on your body. Rice dishes and that kind of street food, which is beautiful 
It's often associated with being unhealthy. This has been made to be healthy. If by healthy you mean disgusting, then Jamie, you are right. You could have that as a meal. I think it's the time to have a little. This rice looks so wet. Look at this. Mm -mm. You can see your. This doesn't look good. The one, um, the one made by the BBC Food Lady, it looks way better than this one. This doesn't look appetizing at all. At all. That one was still looking appetizing. I actually wanted to taste the one she made. But this one, no, no, no. A reflection inside. Mulan is gonna start singing when she sees this rice. So silky and delicious. No. Looks fantastic. Uh uh. And it's really good. I don't fun like it. To make. No. Jamie is professional chef. All the steps he messed up. Does this guy hate rice or something? What else <laughs> has he done with rice? <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh, this guy, I think he just hate rice in general. Maybe he's sponsored by Potato Company. They are competition. Uncle Roger don't like this Jamie Oliver recipe. <coughs> Too wet, no garlic, no MSG. He break the tofu, no wok. It's all wrong. Subscribe to Uncle Roger channel for more video. See you next time. Bye bye. Wow, that was... That was really interesting and i love his sense of humor really really nice uh, i don't i mean cooking with olive oil i don't have a problem with that normally but the rice didn't really come out that nice no he, he, like he said it looked really wet and unappetizing to me but once again this was really fun to watch it was really interesting it was entertaining it was comedy uh, thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you all later.